Okay, and today we're gonna make hot dog, uh, corn dogs. Corn dogs, excuse me. We're gonna make little mini corn dog bites. Um, I've been on Pinterest off and on and have recently become obsessed with bite-sized stuff. So here, um, I the cornbread batter is the video before this. Um, but basically, I'm just going to use my regular old cornbread batter. This isn't gonna, it's, I'm gonna bake these. I'm not gonna fry them. So they are basically going to be like weenies in cornbread. Um, they're not gonna be deep fried and all puffy and greasy and delish like, you know, we would want them to be. Um, this is gonna be a more healthful version, I guess, and a quicker version, if, in my opinion. Um, so, okay, what we're gonna do here is, I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me see if I can adjust you. Okay. So basically what I'm gonna do is, and you're not gonna fill these very much. Um, typically, this cornbread batter makes 36 mini muffins. Um, I am gonna end up probably making two or three batches to accommodate all the batter, but that's okay, because I got like a jumbo, um, a whole bunch of jumbo turkey dogs. So here I have a jumbo turkey dog. I'm going to put it in the bottom of my cupcake liner. And basically, I don't know, um, these are jumbo cupcake liners for jumbo muffins. So, I put one in each. And we'll put the little nubby where? We'll put the little nubby in here. Um, and then basically, just cornbread to cover because this cornbread has, and I'm just using a cereal spoon here, um, this cornbread has um, all of the, and these cupcake liners have been sprayed with um, butter pan. So. And it is, I, I normally do, as y'all know, um, you know, I, pr I like to make elaborate, helpful meals for the fam, but this weekend is a lazy weekend, and I have just decided to do this. And um, you think this is awesome. Next week, I am going to make the most awesome breakfast for my kids, and y'all are just going to love it, and you are going to say, oh my God, that is so ingenious. Um, it's a variation on eggs and potatoes so but right now we're doing corn dogs and just put two or three spoons full in just enough to cover the hot dog and then we are going to we have an oven preheated at 400 degrees so yeah this is taking about three cereal spoons um i think i should actually you know what i'm going to try one with just two cereal spoons this is just a regular spoon for you know that you put on your table um, for your kids to eat cereal with. Um, I am going to try these last two bottom cupcake cuppies down here um, with just two spoons full because I'm afraid that the batter is just going to puff up, you know, and it might be too much. So these two will give me kind of an idea. Um, I'm going to go ahead and complete a whole tray and put them in the oven at 400 degrees for about 20 minutes and we'll come back when we take out the first batch so we can show you what they look like okay and here we have it this is the result of our homemade corn dogs to which i am going to gild the lily and pour some chunky turkey chili over the top and then a oh, little more and then we're going to top with some freshly grated cheese and then some dehydrated chives. That looks good. This is your dinner. All right, and thank you very much, and I hope you give them a try. They're really, really good. The batter is Swedish, but not so sweet like a cake. It is a bread, and it's savory. Watch that plate disappear.